Congratulations on your new hurdy-gurdy. This time around, we're going to talk about and learn how to hold our new instrument. Place the instrument in your lap. You'll want it sitting upright, like how you hold a guitar. Generally, you don't want it laying flat on its back. The reason for this, when we are playing our hurdy-gurdies, we'll be pressing these buttons here to get different notes. When I press the button, it goes in. When I let go, it falls away to disengage. It relies on gravity for that. If the instrument's laying on its back, you could press the keys, but then when you let go, they won't disengage. This can ca cause weird sounds or chattering noises when you're playing. So hold the instrument upright and you'll be good. If you have it kind of at an angle, often that's enough to work, but if the keys are falling away or not, let that be your guide. So if you find you're pressing them and they're not quite releasing, just turn it upright a little more. Next, let's talk about the handle. As we can see, we have the end of the instrument with a handle sticking out. We'll take the ball end and put it in our palm. Just come in sideways with your hand and gently wrap your fingers around it. And there you go. When you're cranking, have kind of a relaxed grip, not too tight. That'll be more comfortable in the long run. A lot of new players want to grab the handle like that. Can you see the difference? That's A lot of new players will do it like that. Don't do that. That's hard on your hands. Just come in sideways, wrap your fingers around it, and you're ready to go. That concludes this video. Hopefully you feel a little more comfortable with your new instrument. Thanks for watching.